today we're gonna make a Peruvian soup called aguadito de pollo. It's one of our favorite soup of them all. As the weather is getting colder, we feel like having something warmer now. So the recipe practically is based on the coriander, chicken, corn, capsicum, onions, peas, a cup of rice, chili, stock cubes and garlic, two liters of water. Without a beer, we cannot make this dish. <laughs> so I found one. <laughs> and a beer. So let's get into it. Make sure to keep watching and don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more adventures. So we're just gonna wash the coriander. Just gonna remove the bottom section. I'm not too fussy, but if you'd like to, you could actually pick each little leaf and buy lots of it. You need at least two to three bunches of coriander. Now I'm just gonna put it in our um, blender. Some more in. A little bit of water. And just to help to blend the coriander, I'm just gonna put a bit of capsicum in there. Another thing that I'm gonna use is a chili called, it's a Peruvian chili called ají amarillo. You could use any chili or you could just not have any at all. But I'm just gonna cut a little bit, just blend it together. This is. So I'm not going to use the seeds. those colors together. Now we're going to blend this. There, we put it aside. Nice. Okay, now we're going to fry the chicken. So we're going to start making the soup. You could have fresh chicken or we just had this in the freezer and because it's gonna boil it doesn't really matter it will get cooked. Just gonna put a bit of oil in oh. just to fry it. Put it high. Get garlic going. Use any sort of garlic you've got around. going to season well so you can put as much as you like or as little as you like of any sort of salt or pepper. Just going to fry the onions. Just going to put the chicken in there. I'm going to add the coriander in here. And I just leave a tiny little bit in there. Just like that. Put it aside. This is how I do it. And so, so far we've got the garlic, fried onions, and the chicken in here. And now I'm going to incorporate the rice and the rest of the vegetables, the water and the stock cubes and we should be done. And it smells quite nice. You can smell the flavor of the coriander now. So it's just uh, quite fragrant in here. Okay, so we fried that a little bit and now I'm just going to add the rice. So it's one cup of rice. Stir it a bit. 
and we're going to add two liters of boiled water. Just gonna put the kettle. It's already hot. So just gonna measure this one cup for two liters of water. Capsicum, maybe just leave a little bit for the end. Salt and tea, and the corn. Stir it a little bit. Now we just let it um, boil for probably half an hour and we'll have a look and see how we go. We're also gonna add a few stock cubes and then later on we will try and see how it um, tastes. So sometimes you need to add a little bit more salt or another stock cube or even some pepper. Let's see what Google says. Aguadito de pollo, also referred to as levanta muertos in English, to wake up the dead, it's a traditional chicken soup in Peruvian cuisine consisting of chicken, coriander and vegetables. So it has been around 15 to 20 minutes so we're just going to have a look at it. And this is what it looks like. And to reduce the, um, the heat, and just so it's not boiling as much. Make sure the curian is removed from the side of the pot. Mm. I wish you could smell that. It smells delicious. What do you think, Danny? It smells yummy. <laughs> so, as you can see, the chicken also is pretty much cooked. So, you don't have to fast trying to cut the bits, pieces of chicken beforehand because it would all just disintegrate, anyways. Let's have a look. I think you could probably not quite as yet. So it's been probably more or less half an hour. So let's just have a quick look. So you just need to make sure that your rice and your vegetables are all cooked. And I'm just going to remove the chicken from the pot. Um, just maybe cut it. I find it easier to cut the chicken when it's cooked than when it's raw for this soup. There we go. You don't have to be too, too picky. Just whatever chunks is so good. We turn the chicken into the soup, and that's pretty much it. So the key ingredient for this soup is actually putting a bottle of beer. <laughs> And so what I did, what I do is I um I put some of it in here and clean the container. So I'm just gonna put that in there. And so I just tip it off and then reduce the heat completely because it's pretty much all cooked. And just pour that in there. So you remove all the curianda. a little bit and I just put this last little bit so the capsicum that we left already this gives it a 
Nascala. And now we're just gonna let it sit in there for a while until we're ready to eat it. So I would say probably for another 20 minutes or so. You can eat it straight away if you like to. But I'll just let it rest. It tastes better. And that's it. Hope you enjoy it. Thank you for watching our first cooking video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to see more. Yes? <laughs> Did you need something? That is a mistake. He's sharing Rexy. <laughs> 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 you should do it.